hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Coffee here and today we're back with a Orlo a sneak peek. Yes. First things first, as usual, huge thank you to the folks over at Orlo for providing this for us today. And what did they provide for me to show for you guys today? You guys are going to love this one. It is called Traveler. Traveler is a square diamond painting with that is a 49.5 by 70 square with AB. So we're going to take a look at this kit and see what we have in store. So I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. And if you're not, do something nice for yourself because you know you deserve it. It's coming up on the holiday season. So believe me, we all deserve it. So we're going to get rid of that plastic and we're going to try to dive into this box without breaking a nail. Hopefully you guys had a wonderful, wonderful weekend. Now this kit as was, will, will be available on Monday. So you're going to want to keep an eye out for this Monday the 23rd or Tuesday the 24th. I'm going to say Monday the 23rd because usually it only happens on Tuesday if something happens like last week. So let's go ahead and get into the plastic. There we go. We're going to unroll it. It's a, it's a big one. <laughs> So we have that CVS receipt that has all your instructions on it. We have our schematic that tells us how many colors. We have our toolkit, which your toolkit is going to come with a pair of colored tweezers. You're going to get a boat, uh, some wax, some tweezers. I said tweezers. We have multi-placers, a squishy, some pens, and some of their little board things. I'm still not sure what those little board things are for, but I'm pretty sure you can make them into like magnets or something. So that is what's in your toolkit, which you don't care about that. Here is your color palette for this particular kit. And yes, you are seeing this in natural sunlight. So that is the colors that will be perceived to you. And then we're going to unroll this kit to see what we got here, shall we? I love the fact that it has a hot air balloon in it. I love hot air balloons. So we're going to roll it this way. Are we ready? Bam. And we're going to smooth it out a little bit just so it's laying flat. So as you can see, look at the little doggo. Look, like we have a camera right here, a book. She's sitting on her windowsill. We got like a little guitar here or a ukulele maybe. Um, we have like plants and stars and moons hanging up. We have a hot air balloon out in the distance. You can see the mountains, boats flying. We have coffee in hand over here or tea, whatever you'd prefer. We have a mirror and some books over here. We also have this beautiful dream catchers. It looks like we're in a bedroom here and someone's looking out the window. This kit is absolutely adorable. So let's take a look at our schematic to see what the information is on this kit again. So Traveler, there is your image. This is coming in, I'm sorry. A f okay, so the box, the box says 49.5 by 70, but the schematic says 55.9 by 70. Am I gonna have to measure this? <laughs> Okay, I'm going to go by 55.9, seeing as how it does look more like a 50 and not like a 40. So we're going to go with 55.9 by 70. These mistakes happen sometimes. I'll let them know um, that there was a little bit of an error on the box there. But this kit is coming in at 62 col Look at all those colors. Look, look, look at all those colors. Oh, my God. And, of course, we do have a couple of ABs coming in with this kit. How pretty is that kit? Oh, my God. So let's take a look at some of the drills, shall we? Now, this is a square kit, and Oraloa has some pretty, really, pretty good squares. So if you haven't tried Oraloa, check out their squares. They are really, really good. And this coming from someone who's super picky about squares. So we're going to do this. And they are in number order, which is why another reason why I don't like taking them out of here, because I'll never get them back in here the same. So we are going to take out some of our special drills here. We do have a couple of those. It looks like we have three coming in on this kit. We have number 61 coming in at 602. We have number two coming, number 60 coming in at 550. And then we have number three coming in at 5200 for number 62. So we have three ABs in this kit. Now, if you're new to diamond painting or a lower or diamond painting in general, I guess, and AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's an iridescent coating that they put on the drill just to make it sparkle a little bit brighter. Also, when you lay these down on your canvas next to your regular drills, it's going to pick up the light from those regular drills and make them sparkle brighter as well. Because if one shines, we all shine, you heard. So there are three of those in this particular kit. And we're going to find out exactly where they go here in just a few minutes. So let's take a look at what symbols we're looking for. We're looking for an anchor. 
we have a diamond and a slash mark. So I already see the slash mark here. But there's a purple anchor that we're going to be looking for. Or a black anchor, maybe? Let's take a look. So you guys can take a look at the drill field to see how clear the drill field is. Nice, clear drill field. And I'm already seeing some of those anchors over here on the side. I'm also seeing some up here at the top. Nope, that's number two. So the anchors I saw were down here with the number two. So they're a little bit darker than that number two. Sorry about that. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and we have some more anchors there. It's rubbing up against the bottom of my tripod. <laughs> so we have some more anchors coming in here. We have some of those slash marks coming in on the doggo. Look how cute the doggo is. We also have some other slash marks coming in on the books. What was the other one? The diamond, the diamond shape. So we gotta find that diamond shape. I'm seeing a couple of those diamonds in the dog's ears. So that light, let's see if I can hold this up so I can show you. So this diamond right here is the diamond that we're looking for. So if you happen to see some of those and I don't see them, that's what you're looking for. So that pile of them right there. Not seeing any over here. I'm seeing a couple of dashes on the cup. So the smoke coming off of the cup is going to have ABs. The curtain itself and the outside looks like it's going to have a lot of the ABs as well. So you're getting some of the ABs down here. That's a lot of check marks, actually. Let's see. Is there any more purples or diamonds or slash marks? You're not seeing any in any of the stuff up here. So it looks like... The ABs coming in on this kit are going to be around the outside of your kit for the most part. So you're going to get a couple of ABs down here on the books. You're going to get some on the doggo down here that's laying nicely on the little pillow or the, the little seat that they're sitting on here. You're going to get some of those ABs in the smoke on the sail that's out here. I thought the background here was going to be ABs, but it's not. So it's the sides here that you see in bright white. Those are going to be ABs. You're also going to get a couple of ABs along the side over here on these books, on the dog's ears, and a couple on this chair. I'm not seeing anything anywhere else, but of course, you can always, always, always go back in and add ABs that you would like to add if you want to add more. If I were going to add ABs to this, I would probably add some to the dream catcher, possibly the mirror. The mirror could even be possibly like a, a 5200 rhinestone, which will kind of give it a cool effect seeing as how it is a mirror. You're going to, you could give like the plants a little bit of sparkle since they're sitting right here next to the window. Um, the hot air balloon. I'm surprised that that doesn't have ABs in it, but you could always, like I said, add your own ABs, add your own flair and style to the kit. Now, again, this kit will be available Monday, October 23rd. And then if it's not available on Monday, because I know there was a hiccup last week, check out for this, this on Tuesday. But I'm pretty sure it should be up on Monday this week. So Monday the 23rd, this kit should be available. I usually get my email, like I said, around noon. So that's going to be about 1 p.m. Eastern, noon Central, 11 Mountain, and 10 Pacific. So if that is a kit that you're interested in, please, please, please go check out Oraloa.com. And it's Oraloa Island of arts to the diamond painting and thank you again so much for the folks over at Oraloa. I greatly greatly appreciate it and thank you to you for watching. Now you already know how we do. If you have any other questions, comments, or concerns about this kit, please leave them down in the comment section below. But before we go, let's take a look at some of these drills so that you can see the quality of their squares. And I'm not torn away by if I see any trash or anything. You want to watch out for some of those problem drills, but for the most part, their drills are usually really, really good. You see every once in a while, you'll see like little knobbly bits on there like that. But other than that, for the most part, most of the drills look really, really good. So again, they come in with really good squares. So again, if you haven't checked them out, feel free to check them out. I will have a link to Oraloa's website down below because usually by the time I make these videos, obviously the kit's not going to be up yet. So I will have at least a link to their new releases and it should pop up for you there. With that said, I must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you that it's hard out here in these crafty streets. So please stay safe and always remember to be kind to others because you never know what somebody else is going through. Be courteous because it's the right thing to do and always stay cool. And whether I see you in YouTube land or I see you on Twitch, either way, I'll see you when I see you. Bye guys.